And I'm back. Sorry about that. Probably just a little, yeah, it would have been a little cut for you. But, uh, there's some crazy stuff going on outside. Uh, people drunk so early in the day. Oh, so early in the day, it's only nine, but... Dun, dun, dun. And let's carry on with this. So, tsh. Right, what we got here? I'm not using my mana thing, so let's put the amulet. The grain hearts we gained after. Right, let's put that one there. There we go. So we got a mana card now, finally. It's only a matter of time. Let's go here. Or something. Use it. Let's get that one. Let's see what this bookshelf is about. There we go. Great. Oh, sun rune. So we've got two sun runes. Good. I like that. Got some XP bonus. Okay. Oh, the stars aren't available. There we go. I get hit by the fire as well. Uh, I, yeah. I thought I was immune to it, which I need the shoes on below my feet. Alright, so let's go. We got three more runes to find out. Points of interest, sorry. There we go. There we go. Go back. There we go. Um, let's keep over him. No. I like that. There we go. Oh, we got a spider. What's this? Mini spiders? There we go. Can I hit you? Are you immune? There we go. Are we, are we attacking? Are we doing something? There we go. Ah, oh, it's a time. There we go. There we go. Your spiderlings. Uh, 
There we go. There we go. Don't care, I'm getting hurt. Immune. Spiderlings. There we go. There we go. You're dead. There we go. Boom. Free. Got something special that. So I need to get some good cards on me. Uh, I need the potion. I got the fro. I need the amulet. I need. Alright, there's that. So I need the cards now. Give me that. I need to find some health in this level. There we go. Oh, so I don't have any health. So let's put that back there. have one of them. Put that down, use that. Put that back. Hmm. How many missiles are incoming? Let's see. I haven't discovered everything here. Health restored per minute, 20. Let's go in, 3, 2, 1. Where's he going to teleport to? Fine. I'm happy with that. So that gets one less guy out of there. Right. I need to. Am I going to do this? I need to kill. Yeah, let's go. There we go. There we go. And go in. There we go. There we go. That's how we do it. And then we go here. Let's get you. I don't care. You try and stun me. There we go. Wow, that was intense. There we go. All cleared. Done. That was intense, guys. It's a pretty long episode. Alright, so let's just check we got everything. I'm gonna have a drink. Need to take the top off my drink.
Oh, it respawns, ace. Alright. I think we did do everything. Ah, that's amazing. Which way is that? I think it's the right now. One more level. Wow. Back to town. Refill me, please. Alright. Upgrade cards. So this will go into level 2 with various magical boons. The rare is. Chance to stun any monsters. 20%, 20%. Potion effects are more effective, 50%. Other card cooldown time is reduced. Okay. That's quite cool. What we got here? So what I'm going to do here at the moment is I'm going to fuse them together. Right. There we go. One. Two. Fuse. Boom! There we go. Now I've got one of these. And I think that means any rune. So that's cool. Oof. We're good. So what I'm going to do is go into the Magical Cauldron. How many prizes we got? We got three. Let's risk this. If we, if we do this level, we can when do it. When I was still a young monk, we used to jest that dull brothers excel in copying holy texts, and those with any wit left became master brewers. <laughs> uh, uh, it does not sound very amusing now, but it would bring us to tears back then. Monastic life can be very monotonous, you see. Regardless, potion brewing was our specialty. It required hours of prayer and meditation. Nowadays, even a barmaid can procure a potent mixture with one hand, while stuffing a turkey with the other. And the magical cards allow you to use objects that you don't even have to carry. You might think that as a man devoted to matters of the spirit, I may object to the methods of the fortune teller. Normally this would be true, but in such dire times, when darkness threatens the light, we need all to use their talents to oppose evil. I believe her gifts are a godsend. So, guys, uh, leave in the comment description below. So this is going to be the end of this episode. You're going to find out if I make this uh, this route in the next episode. But uh, tell me if you think with the backstory between the uh, fortune teller and the sage. Uh, write in the comment section. Let me know. Uh, it'll be nice to hear your thoughts of it this far. Anyway, guys, until next time, stay safe. Be cool. Stay awesome. Goodbye.